My name is Anna Correa. I am 20 years old and I'm studying international relations with a certificate in environmental studies. So I found out about this uh, Blue Energy opportunity through the Global Learning Office. Blue Energy is a nonprofit organization and they are focused on providing uh, sustainable energy development, uh, water and sanitation, and climate change adaptation. So I went to Nicaragua with Blue Energy for five weeks and we got to work with the community, live with the community, and understand at a better scale the global issues that are going on today and their complexity. The main motive for this project was due to climate change. A lot of the people weren't being able to grow the foods that they normally grew in season just because either there was a drought or there were long periods of rain and they would damage the harvest. And our job was to find which foods are better grown in homes or to build a home garden. So I felt a deeper connection to this project being one of the members in the field actually doing the work because when we were, you know, back in the Blue Energy house, kind of like sitting down, kind of getting all the data and stuff, it, was, it wasn't to be given to someone else, it was to be worked on among ourselves. Um, so trying to see how we can be more efficient when we, the, when we did the reviews, seeing how, what kind of questions we needed to keep, what questions we needed to add, and how can we get the most information that we could from, from the interviews and from talking to the families. And when it came to giving them advice on how to grow something, uh, it, was, it was really like us giving it to them because we had research or we had heard from other families and being able to give them that one-on-one -on -one, uh, communication was very rewarding also. This was a life-changing experience for me because having done this internship really allowed me to realize that my bigger passion was actual international relations. I've changed my major and I've decided to go to grad school later on to study international sustainable development. This internship abroad prepared me for the field work that I could be doing in the future um, because it prepared me to work with different communities, doing different field work, working with different um, ethnicities and and even just working out of my comfort zone, uh, which was one of the biggest things that I took away from this trip, was getting out of my comfort zone and really being able to dig down within myself and be able to be uncomfortable but still enjoy what I'd be doing. Uh, and then getting comfortable with being uncomfortable.